One thing that I can certainly say about being an MEP is that no week is like the following week. And this week has been no exception. It's been something very different. We had a major announcement from the Commission about the billions that they were going to, to raise to invest in the economy, to kickstart the economy, to create jobs. Now, there are a lot of doubts about whether or not this scheme will work, and I share those doubts. But at the same time, I very much welcome the fact that the Commission now is talking about investing, about creating jobs, about having money for, for major schemes that will really make a difference and of course we need that in Wales and we want to involve the private sector more in developing our economy as well. We've also had uh, a visit from the Pope Pope Francis came to speak to members of Parliament and we've also listened to people from other countries who were nominated for the Sakharov Prize, which is something the European Parliament gives for freedom of thought, people who have battled against many hardships to have the right to speak freely and to work for human rights. And that's something that, that's always, every year when we give the prize, it's always a very moving experience to hear about those experiences and how we can learn from what excellent work is done by people in other countries. This week too, I'll be taking part in a debate in Cardiff on the future of Wales in Europe, but the future of Cardiff in Europe as well, as a city and the people who live in Cardiff, particularly the young people, because things are changing all the time. And my priority, as you a Member of Parliament, is to always look at how these changes affect Wales and to make sure that Wales is ready to take advantage of every opportunity to strengthen our economy. So that's why I've called on the Welsh Government this week to be ready to have a plan in place so that when this Commission proposal comes forward next year and, and if it all goes well and if things start next June that Wales will be in a position to play a full part in that so we can create jobs for our young people.